Hey guys, Brett Rose here, back on the Bratcraft server, and you probably don't recognize this building, because this is a new building I built a while ago, but sadly couldn't record because my internet was being a bit iffy. So, this is my interior decoration shop building, and pretty much what this is, is, um... For people who feel a bit lazy to decorate their inside of their place, I'll come in here and decorate. Like I did at McDonald's here, that Sparkworks 101 did. I gave them a nice little carpet, a new M, a little chandelier, and pretty much that's about it. As you can see, there's a new KFC. <laughs> Competition. Da, da, da. KFC versus McDonald's. But what I really want to show you guys is the progress I have been doing off camera on the Nether Hub. Now, I did record a episode of my survival LP, but I scrapped it and. I'm going with Bratcraft's going to be my new survival LP. Because no matter what, like, <laughs> in that episode, I got lost. Like, I could not find my base. I guess traveled around the entire place, could not find my base. Okay, but, um, you know what? I'll put my wool somewhere. Where did I put it? Where did I put my wool? It's probably in the upstairs chest. But yeah, and with the interior decoration shop, you pretty much put your name in here, like Sparky did, and then I'll contact them on Skype, or whatever works for them. Chat or whatever. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to head to the shop. <laughs> we call this the Brat Triple O Seven District, or the Brat District for short, because he owns every shop right here, and pretty much the stable is like the line. <laughs> the circling, he just bought everybody out there. So here's another hub. As you can see, we have our poofy little clouds. I'm trying to make this look like this is above ground and whatnot. Poofy clouds. And then when you go down here, it's like you went underground. So you have this nice stone floor. You have dirt. And when you go down here, it takes you to the outside of the nether. Which would... Probably down here would be where our shops would be. If we decide to do another shops. Or if see, see how they're all in a corner or something? People can just tear out this part and make that another shop. Like you can't tear out this side because another person might want to put some like put their track that far out. But with this you can just tear out this corner pretty much and then have your shop, so I'm gonna actually do that. Let's tear out part of this. Part track there, that there, and take out this, and make this walkway into a shop so people can put in their cobblestone. I haven't been doing any work on the uh, floating island. Thing besides Brat 007's uh, level 30 enchantment shop, okay. he, <laughs> I sort of paid him to get me a sh silk touch shovel. He got a silk touch shovel, so I grabbed some grass and uh, yeah, now there's actually grass up there. And stuff. Sparky decided not to live with me, so we come to agreement about this little vacation house. Just a little vacation house down there. I do have clouds on, which gives this island a really cool mist sort of feel. 
Looks like here's like mist and stuff. Yeah. It's pretty much what I want. Like this looks cool, man. Like, like and I forgot to mention I did uh deepen the uh, Oasis Island. Because I didn't have my beds under there, my bed is still under there. I forgot, I, for, I forget if I told you that Gundero and Piper died. Uh, I was climbing up the ladder one day, and Gundero, just when I came, like, I was, like, coming, like, out here, and all I see is Gundero die, like, just die on the spot. I was like, what? And then I see Piper randomly just die, and I was like, is this a glitch or something? Like, I don't remember dogs just randomly dying like this. So yeah. Plus, I really don't want to have a dog because if we enter the death games, people will start killing them. Yeah. Right, I need to pick. So, I know I put wouldn't pick someone. This is my nether base thing. <sighs> so yeah, it's pretty much been fun on my uh, survival LP thing. I turned down the volume because you. Oops. I turned down the volume because of um, the dropper sounds. I changed up how you get down there now. Instead of going up here, you go uh, down here over the chest and pretty much just drop down there. <laughs> That's another brick. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's time to fill the thing up. Um, I also moved the hoppers around back here because. It used to go this way. Yeah. Uh, instead of going this way, it used to go the other way. But the fern eye that got like the first, um, like that gets all the load is right there. So it got like the least amount of lava buckets than these two. So I had to switch that around so this one gets the most and this one gets the least because by you know because like the one that does the most work, needs the most lava buckets out of it all. Rat 007 tried this, almost died. Sparky Bars tried it, almost died. I tried it. Eh, just have to hug the wall and trust. Just have to trust that wall is going to protect you forever. Um, so, yeah. There's no more. Uh, let's survive with Brett Rose. Unless if I get like banned from the server or something. Try. Oh, I did see some of the new and cool things in 1.7, and uh, woo, can't wait for that. Pretty much. I forget what Brett Triple said it said, but it was like 20 new biomes or something like that. Some of them I wouldn't really count as, like, a biome biome. Like, the Bruce, uh, sp uh no, no, yeah, the roof, no, other not that, is it? I mean, like, the birch forest, it's just a forest with the oak trees, pretty much, and it's, like, still just a forest for me, so. I keep, sometimes I forget to put, like, the lava buckets in the spent, uh, in the droppers. And I guess take them up with me, and it's pretty weird. There's the one picks. So pretty much, oop, I leave that open when I'm in here. Uh, so pretty much we're going for a up, like above ground feel on the top floor. A, I would say a. Underground feel down there, which is done. 
just let that go off the track or whatever. So I'm just going to take out about here, power rail there. I don't think I didn't get about YouTube. Um, I were in a minecart here. Should I? Oh, fine. Here's why it's not good. Oh, we got that. Uh, we got to power that one. So, did I get the lever? Yes, I did. Pretty much. You would go. I'm only scared there's lava behind blocks. Got one rail to spare. Good thing. Uh, and then you're gone. And then the store will be back here. So it's gonna be like a tiny little store or whatever. And that's stored back here. I'll have like Chest here. And it's gonna be the get rid of cobble shop. And I'm just putting this store here because I have like my cooker thing over there. So it's just simpler for me to have a secondary rail of some sort. Like a uh, hopper minecart, you know, chest with a minecart on it and you could go that way. And me running back and forth. So yeah. That's pretty much about it for today, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, I think that's pretty much it for today. Um, I just want to see how this looks. I want to wait for Sky. Yeah, that looks nice. Gets all that, yeah, another act of stuff out there. So yeah, I guess that's the end of the episode. This is Brett Rose saying see you next time.